of the things that we learned today is, you know, that, that sudden um, realization that, hey, we're working so hard for our money, but we are not sure if it is eroding away. So what are we going to do with this? What are we going to do about it? Because if you stand back and do nothing, it's not true that nothing is going to happen, right? So I hope that today you did learn something and you have come to realize that it is so important that you take charge. One from over here and it is, I'm getting a sensation, a vibration, it's, 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 it's you. <laughs> I think uh, today I learned about um, like what um, Dr. Kong mentioned about uh, setting priority to set time aside to really look into how we how we spend our money, how we uh, save and make plans even for retirement mm -hmm. in time to come, uh, and also uh, not to put all our eggs in one basket, mm -hmm. but to actually uh, you know look into how we can get our financial uh, advisor to help us in our investments and also. Mm -hmm. Let's go over there. Let's, you're smiling so much, you, you clearly knew I was going to ask you. <laughs> what have you learned today? What's your name? Um, Diane. Diane! Yeah. Um, Diane's going to share with us what you learned today. Um, actually, I'm very interested uh, to come today because uh, I think it's time for me to start uh, taking ownership of finances because I've not been doing anything about it. And um, I think um, I'm, I'm, I am taking more towards the conservative kind of approach, where because I do not know what's going on, so I I, I don't take risks. Mm. So I think um, this workshop is very good for me to know what are the different avenues that I can actually put my money in for investment mm. and how I can actually maximize my money. Okay, I find this course very informative, and I certainly want to make money work for me when I'm sleeping and not the other way around. Yeah, yeah because if money works for me, uh, rather than I work very, very, very hard for my money. Yeah, that's all. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I think this is very informative because as teachers, I sometimes we don't have time to really find out all these things, and, uh, and now it's like all be gathered together and it's refreshed sometimes. It now get me by thinking what are the insurance that I bought, <laughs> policies. And so I think it's, it is good for teachers. Well, uh, this seminar has been very interesting and informative. And I also enjoyed the interactive element, the opportunity to be able to learn more about financial literacy and also to apply the knowledge in our daily lives. So this uh, seminar is also very practical and I, I found it really useful and I would certainly encourage my colleagues to take part in it and to learn more while having a good time. Thank you.